Why is your door open? Keanu. Keanu! I'm sorry. Stitches. He's uh, he's the silent but dangerous character. And so, did you learn anything working with all oh, that? Me, oh, I ain't play. I see over there. I ain't play. I see over there. Yeah, yeah. Really funny. So, did you learn anything working with all that comedy talent? Because there was a bunch of. Oh, I absolutely. Oh, I absolutely did. Be on your ish. And I also learned that. Um, can I learn? Oh yeah, that when the camera's not on you, that's not your shot. So you don't really gotta do nothing but just chill. I'm Jamar Neighbors. And um, in a new Key and Pill movie. Do a little bit of your character for me. What? Do a little bit of your character in the movie. Give us a taste. Nah. <laughs> Not even a little bit? No, no, that's his line. Uh, my name is Lou Rail Howery. Uh, I'm on the show, The Carmichael Show on NBC, which comes out every Sunday night. Uh, I'm here to support Jamal and Tiffany and Jordan. Uh, this is really exciting. You know, see, like, your friends and trailers and stuff like that. So I'm here strictly, like, I'm supposed to go to the, uh, like, I'm going to see this movie twice. <laughs> and so how happy are you for Tiffany? Because this is, like, a pretty big role for her, right? I'm so happy for her, yes. You know, she's a lead female actress in the movie, and she plays my ex-wife in the show, so it's like almost like I had to be, I don't, I don't know, maybe, we're not married for real or nothing, but it's like I feel like I had to be here anyway, so I'm so proud of Tiffany. Well, we're both big fans of Key and Peele, Peele so, fans. you know, I, we, we're not going to get to see the TV show anymore, so this is it, you know, we, we got to got to see him on the big screen. Sorry, but what's okay, your favorite yeah. sketch? That, that, that's, that's an easy okay. one for me because there was one that I have to watch once every month. Okay. It, 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 yes, yeah, yeah. It, it, it was called I'm Retired. I had to watch that once, at least once every month. Okay, and why? Like, why exactly? Well, I mean, coming from the action world, I think they lampoon action movies, especially those 80s, 90s style action movies so well with the with the, uh, with the score and everything. And just, uh, it, they just did that so well. I, I, just, I think it's a masterpiece. My name is Michael Jai White. I'm Gillian White. And we're giving a shout out to all hip hop. This is uh, Gillian. So what are you most excited about being at this premiere? I'm most excited about seeing what this, you know, the whole ordeal about like what's going on with this cat. You know? And then Kill Hill, I'm big fans of them. I watch all this stuff all over YouTube. I think it's cool that they asked me to come out. And uh, so I'm pretty good at this movie. Really nice and so for people who might not think like this is hard enough, like or something with the cannon, what do you have to say to them? I mean, somebody always got something negative to say about something. You know what I'm saying? So we can't let that deter us. We, we out here, um, you know, obviously for something huge, you know. Anything with red carpet is huge. They got red carpet in my grandma's house. It's always an event when I go over there, you know? So, yeah, we here, we just gonna have fun. So, hey, yo, it's game, man. All hip hop, you know what it is, man. We here, it's LA. You guys can look this way, right here, with the white hat. I actually watched this series, and you know, they dope. You know, I be laughing at home. I watch them on Netflix, and they, they funny to me, so I'm here to see what they're gonna say and what they're gonna do. So you think, like, maybe more people in our community should actually know about Kim Yeah, they should, especially two black people coming up. Yeah, of course, they better. Absolutely. That's like a living color and all that. We need to support those shows. Right? Mm -hmm. right there. Definitely. It's your boy Captain AB, aka Mr. Money Dance, is giving a big, big, big shout outs to all here. Like, what's going on? I'm at the Keanu premiere. I'm so excited because I love Key and Pele, and I'm just trying to see this movie and have a good time. I haven't been out the house in a minute. So. <laughs> and so, do you have anything like that we should be that's coming up that we should be looking out for from you? Well, all hip hop always supports me. So, I have a new single with Jeremiah called Say So, and it's on iTunes, Tidal, Spotify. Support your girl. Hazelie, VH1, Love and Hip Hop Hollywood. It's that OG baby. <laughs> and so, is there any like Key and Peele that you like? I mean, I'm looking forward to it. I want to see him in Keanu. I want to see how this comes together on the big screen. Like, you know, it's a big picture and it's a big look for them. So, congrats. What's up, everyone? It's your girl Hazel E. And shout out to all hip hop. I'm so happy to be getting the first look because I've been hearing the anticipation. People have been talking about this movie since last year. So, to be one of the first people to see it, I'm uber excited. Okay. And is there anything we can expect to see from you, like this coming up? Yes, soon? you can absolutely. I am Dope Boy, aka Fat Drake. I dropped the Hotline Bling video. We did 20 million, and we dropping something new coming real soon. Views from the Twix. Uh -huh.
gonna be crazy. My name is Meg Scoop. I'm a host for All Deaf Digital, the show The Drop. And I'm here because I love Keanu Hill. Keanu is hilarious. And All Deaf Comedy Live is just probably one of the most amazing events in Hollywood. Everybody should come to it because it's so much fun. So it's been said that a lot of people, like, you know, within like the minority communities, our communities, they don't know as much about Keanu Hill. Yeah. So how important do you think this movie is going to be? So this is going to be really big. And, and, and on one hand, that's a bad thing that our community doesn't know about Keanu Hill because they're amazing and they're super funny. But on the other hand, it does mean that they're open to a lot of communities, a lot of other people that do know about them, which is good because as black people, we just want to start with our group and then branch out so that everyone loves us as much as our people love us. But he kind of, they kind of did it the other way, which is fine. You can catch me every day on The Drop. You can also catch uh, me on this dude stuff right here. All of his stuff on The Drop, on All Deaf. You catch us. Make sure you catch All Deaf Digital, all of our stuff. What up? It's me, Meg Scoop. Shout out to all hip hop. We love you guys. We've been trying to get away since the first big film came out anyway, so uh, it's very entertaining and I want to see how it goes. And is there anything, like, uh, do you think anything's going to surprise you in this movie, or do you think it's going to be, like, you know, just grade A key and peel? They, they always surprise me. They always hit something new. They always come from another angle. So, yeah, I'm looking for a lot of surprises. I mean, they, they're, they just, they are on top of their comedy game, so I want to see what it is in the film, especially when you can, you know, you have time to get it right. I'm sure they got it right. Can you do uh, three of the shows that like swing? You want to see that ass? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely, since it's like that. <laughs> Yes, for all hip hop, you always give an incredible interview. Thank you. And you always have these incredible looks. You were well, wearing you the know, locks, and now you got this hair. Now I'm a Malia, 2015. <laughs> Not 16, 15. I was thinking a little Tina Turner. I oh, well, you like know that. what? Rolling. Oh, you know what I do. <laughs> so this time I wanted to ask you, like, can you tell us a little bit about your role in Kiana? Uh, I play a character named High C, who is the right hand man lady in the game Blitz. In the blips, what to do? And um, yeah, I'm basically like second in command, and uh, we we running this dope. So, what did you like the most about that character? What I like the most about that character is she saw through the mess. She could tell things is not real. You have so many people like that I interviewed before who are out here for you. Like, how how good does it feel to see like people from Carmichael show and everything that they're so happy for you? How much how is that for you? That feels awesome. You know, uh, I support a lot of people, and when they support me back, it's like it's like really having somebody that cares. It's awesome. This is Tiffany Haddish coming straight at you from all hip hop. Let's go. We ready. She ready. Check it out. Hold on, hold on. Let's get a subject. How about Chris shoes? My shoes? <laughs> <laughs> My shoes. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's good. My shoes, what else? Leopard. Huh? Donald Trump. Donald Trump. What else? Getting money. Getting money. Getting money. I'm sitting on stage, just chilling, trying to do my thing. Looking at Chris Shoes and they blame, blame, blinding me. I don't know what to do up in this motherfucker. I'm just trying to have fun up in this motherfucker. Spending my money working on NBC. Yeah, bitch, it's me. Foster care, didn't you see? Bad as a motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. What else did he say? Oh, yeah, unicorns. That's what's up. I'm the last black unicorn. Tap me with my horn. If you fuck me over, I guarantee you, you won't get my fucking home. I'm bad at shit. I tell myself this shit every day in the mirror. Bitch, I'll be like, look at you, sick of me. You a bad motherfucker. Fuck the foster care, fucker. You a bad motherfucker. The judge told you you wasn't gonna be shit. And now that motherfucker. And a movie ticket, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I got so many emotions. I got, I got laughter. I know it was bicolor. It was bicolor. <laughs> My dick was hard and I cried. <laughs> um, but yeah, <laughs> we gonna watch the movie. We're gonna show you how to have fun again. The hashtag is um, Kiyama All Death. We're gonna share it on your share it on social media. You know what you're here. I curse that the ticket was free. I don't know why I paid for more, but I did. I'm just saying, it's down. I'm finished being hot. Everybody, <laughs> <laughs> no dang.